What's up with the crew? Your boy KG. Back up in this thing, man. Today's video, man, we're going to uh, think about doing a little um, a little business venture. I uh, really don't know yet. I'm, I'm thinking about it. Uh, I'm down here at this new development uh, downtown. Don't want to get a name or nothing like that right there out just yet. I don't know if I'm going to go about doing, I'm thinking about investing, I'm thinking about buying a condo and um, Airbnb, Airbnb it out. Um, as y'all can see, right over here by AC Hotel. These go for about 150, 160, five star hotel. Um, then you got the embassy right here. And if I ain't mistaken, they go for like Shit, I want to say about 160 170 a night, and uh, the MC is usually pretty packed, uh, it's pretty much sold out, especially when they have big events like that right there. And well, uh, the one I'm thinking about getting is literally next door to it within walking distance of the Civic Center, uh, a few steps from downtown, uh, Big Spring Park, what we call it. Uh, so just uh thinking about it um don't know yet i'm finna go ahead and take a look at it uh i'm gonna look, check out a few options either one bedroom or two bedroom i'm thinking of one bedrooms i could probably do anywhere from 90 to maybe 110 a night because it's still better than the embassy and it's still better than the ac but if i get a two bedroom then i probably can do that for Maybe 150 a night. One, I don't. I, I don't know. I gotta. I gotta look into it. I, I'm kind of in there. I gotta do my look. I gotta do my research on it and uh, see what it's gonna cost. I mean, the cleaning and all that. I do that my damn self, so I ain't gotta worry about the upkeep. Um, what else I gotta think about? You know, furnishing it and all that kind of stuff. There, it, it, it's gotta come into play. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna. Get in here and check it out. I really don't want to record because I don't know how they feel because it's a new development. So uh, what we're going to do is I'm going to uh, turn this camera around. I'm just trying to kind of show you how to build it real quick, just the outskirts of it. And uh, shit, we're going to go from there. When I get inside, uh, I'll turn y'all back on. All right. All right, crew. So, yeah, that's the, uh, that's the condos right here. Um, you also got the AC Hotel right there. Like I said, you got the embassy over there. So, um, we'll go ahead and check it out. See what they're talking about. Um, like I said, it's a it's a stone or that a, a stone's throw from the park, which is right over there. We see them trees in the background. Like I said, we got the Civic Center literally steps to the left. Um, I think it'd be a good investment, especially if I can get one of them ones right up here on the top. Corner lot. It's got a uh, balcony. Guess what? That's even more. Uh, it's just a plus. So, yeah, we're going to get in here and we're going um, to check it out. And uh, once I get to walk around the park, and I'll turn y'all back on. All right. All right, crew. Yes, yeah, so we made it into a, uh, a two-bedroom. Two bath, got the wash and dry. Um, yeah, pretty nice, pretty nice. Got a nice little, um, little granite. A little kitchen area, stainless steel. Yeah, I think it look pretty decent. Uh, nice size living area, uh, not too big, not too small. Like I said, I'm trying to turn into an Airbnb. Uh, one of the bedrooms here. And yeah, the bedroom is on the smaller side. Come into the bathroom. Got the uh, granite. Turn some lights on with this joke. Yeah. Granite, just bring the tip of the bathroom. It's got a deep ass to it, though. You need to have some, uh, some jets off up in this joke. But it's pretty much on the nice side, though. Yeah, it's okay. I like to uh, like shower here. 
Um, it's okay, but like I said, I'm trying to turn it into an Airbnb, so it really won't make a difference as far as um, what I'm concerned about that right there. Like I said, it's an investment. That's all I'm looking for, bedroom one. Got a nice little patio right here, too. Um, got your pool. Let's go ahead and take a look. Second bedroom. Uh, like I said, a little small uh, on the small side. Bathroom, double sink. Uh, got a little storage space. Bath tiles and a uh, little good stuff there. Uh, for the most part, though, just your ordinary. Ah, this one got a stand-up shower, though. Ah, okay, that's pretty cool, though. Yeah. I think I might be able to get about 140, 150 a night for this right here, to be honest with you. Not too, too much, but I mean, I ain't trying to knock myself out of uh, I no money. You know, I try, I'm trying to be cheaper than the hotels. That's what I'm trying to do. Um, but yeah, that's what we got, man. This is a two-bedroom right here. Um, and when I get home, I'll break down the price on it and, and, and give you an estimate about what I could pay for it versus um, how much it costs to be an Airbnb, how much it's going to cost to um, decorate to get two beds, living room suit, come with a wash and dry. So that's a, that's a big plus there, big plus. Uh, and two full separated beds two full separated baths that's a that's a plus so yeah i think uh we're gonna check out another one we're gonna check out another one and uh hey who knows we'll see what we got but if you're sitting there watching video man make sure you like share subscribe comment click that notification bell turn to all post notifications join the crew but I'll take y'all back on when we get to another one. I'm going to look at a one-bedroom. This is a two-bedroom. And I'm going to look at different floor plans to kind of like get an idea of what I want. So once I get to the next one, I'll turn y'all back on in a minute. All right. All right, crew. Back at y'all with a nut. Uh, two-bedroom, two-bath. Pretty much the same layout. Um, it's a little cheaper because it doesn't have a balcony which is the only the only down part um i think it's more enjoyable as far as if it had a balcony because you know some people smoke and there's gonna be no smoking so they have an option to go out on the balcony but with this one they won't and this one is more handicap accessible um i'm thinking because of the rails and stuff like that right there Bathtub isn't as big. Um, turn some lights on. Yeah, it isn't as big. Closet. Yeah, I can tell by how low your uh, hangers are. It's a uh, handicap. Yeah. This one gonna be for the handicap. Yeah, so. Um, like I said, it's cheaper. Um, the doors are wider too because of the accessibility uh, for wheelchairs and stuff like that right there. So, yeah, kind of mm, up in the air about this one, to be honest. Um, like I said, the bedroom's pretty much the same. Bathrooms, pretty much the same. Oh yeah, this right here most definitely 
It's handicap. Look at uh to doesn't have one. Doesn't have one at all, so here in the closet, the same thing about how low the uh, clothes rack is. Yeah. Handicap accessible. But right there, just a small tour of this one. Like I said, I'm gonna look at three or four um floor plans. Oh, um, gotta show y'all still got the double vanity and all that stuff there, so that's all right there. I just um don't care for it because it doesn't have the balcony. That that's a that's a big one for me. Don't care nothing about that right there. So um other than that, everything else is pretty much same layout and everything. But we're gonna go to the next one and we'll turn you back on in a minute. All right, crew. I wasn't gonna even show y'all this in person. I feel like it's a joke, but Just like being in a hotel room, like seriously, it's just like it. Except you got, I don't know what you call this area here. It'll be the closet. Got the washing dryer, which is a good thing. It's behind here. Ah, okay. Okay, now you got a whole nother clothes. Um, yeah, and it, this this just ain't going. Man, I, I don't think this is very. Nah, nah. And again, what's the purpose of having a view with no balance? I don't, nah, I, I think this right here, and, and the price is pretty much just a little bit cheaper than the two bedrooms, but this is, this is, I'm just like, what am I supposed to do with this right here? Like, seriously, maybe make a bedroom here bedroom here but then where you gonna put the tvs and yeah anyway y'all uh that's enough for this one right here so i'll turn y'all back on when we get to the next one. Oh man i think this might be the last one um still a one bedroom a little different you got shower let's sit down like Lorraine here. Nice. You lean out here to a bedroom. Uh, Cloud space is decent, but I'm not really worried about that part. Um, I just don't know about these, the layouts on these right here. Um, kind of I don't know like a lot of dead space a lot of dead space now, now this one is similar to the one you seen before but the, you see this one is a lot it has a little bit more space oh look at here y'all look y'all see that hey there buddy what you doing now? Hmm? What you doing now? Huh? I said, what you doing? Huh? Oh. I said, what is it doing? Is that an egg or what?
Alright y'all, we done went from looking for a condo to turning to the animal planet. <laughs> But yeah, it, uh, it's, it, it, it's, it's doable, I guess. It's doable. Like I said, it's just going to be an Airbnb, so I'm not really looking like to move in or nothing like that right there. It's strictly business purposes only as an investment. Um, so... Y'all seen the options I have. Uh, drop down in the comments. Let me know what you think. Uh, you know, which one which one might get more bang for the buck. Uh, I think it's one more I might want to see. And if it is, I'm going to turn y'all back on. If not, then I'll end the video in a little bit. But, uh, yeah, that's about it on this one right here. Like I said, it, it, it's a little better than the other one. Uh, still kind of small. I don't... Uh, we'll just have to see. We'll just have to see. So, I'll turn y'all back on when I get to the next one. All right. All right, crew. They always say, say the best for last. So, we got another two-bedroom, two-bath. But the good part about this in here is, bam. Yes, sir. Balcony overlooking downtown. Like I was telling y'all, go to Civic Center right there. So, yeah. I think this is the one right here. I think this is the one right here. Nice little chill spot. You know what I'm saying? They be having concerts and shit out here in the park. Hey, nice little patio furniture out here. Sit back just to some jazz and all the real good stuff there. So, yeah, I think this is the one right here. Hold on, let me close this door. Man, what the hell? Oh. Oh, well, it is what it is. But yeah, like I said, everything is here. Everything. And I ain't gonna waste my time trying to show y'all about the bathrooms and all that stuff there, because y'all haven't seen it all. Already, you know what I'm saying? It's got the shower, the double vanity, full stove. I mean, a uh, shower, little bit of closet, but hey, we'll deal with it. And they brand new, so I know I can get top dollar, top dollar because they brand new. Like I said, don't need no big old bed, queen size, little TV hanging up on the wall. Get some Wi-Fi in here. Little stuff like that right there. But uh, I think that's the one. But if you'd have made it this far to the video, man, you should have been hitting that subscribe button already. Go on, click on uh, the bell, turn on all post notifications, and hey, join the crew. Yeah, that's what it is, man. I think we're going to go down here and, uh, you know, I'm going to uh, get home tonight and uh, crunch some numbers and everything. We're going to... Uh, we're going to see where it go. You know, we're going to see where it go. And um, if it go through, then, hey, it's an investment. If it don't, then we'll keep on looking. But anyway, man, it's your boy KG. Checking out with a nut, man. I'm out. In the, in the penthouse suite. Peace.